Hello guys, Soft Tony here and welcome back to my channel and in today's video we will be creating a looping dynamic background animation here in After Effects. This method is quick and effective, perfect for adding and engaging background to your project. So without any further ado, let's begin. Alright, we're here in After Effects and now let's create new composition, control or command plus N or this little icon and like usual this is gonna be final 9020 by 1080 30 fps 20 seconds long. Hit OK, now let's go right click to create new solid layer and I will just type BG for background. Alright, hit OK, go here in the facts and freeze it and let's find fill effect. Drag and drop onto the background and here pick up whatever color you want, I will do dark pink color, maybe this one. Hit OK and now let's go right click to create another solid layer and this is gonna be grid. Also full HD, hit OK, go here in the facts and preset and let's find grid effect. This one drag and drop onto the solid layer and here for the border I will do 10. Alright and now let's find another effect, this is gonna be CC Collide effect, drag and drop also on the grid solid layer. And here let's make further adjustments. For this option mirroring, let's change from flower to die across. Alright, check this option floating center. And now let's go here at zero frames and set up the first keyframe for the center. And then let's go all the way to around 20 seconds and type here 5000. Now let's hit zero and we already have this cool looking seamless animation of our shapes. Alright, now let's make this even better looking. Let's select this grid solid layer once again, go here in the facts and preset and find glow effect. Drag and drop onto the solid layer. And here for the glow threshold, let's type 100. For the glow radius, let's go to around 30. And as you can see, this is already looking better. Alright, for the next step, let's duplicate this grid solid layer. Hit Ctrl plus D. For the blending mode, let's change here to overlay. And for the next step, let's also add another effect, go here again and find Triton. Alright, drag and drop onto the first solid layer and change highlights to whatever color you want. I will do this one, maybe again, dark or bright pink color. Hit OK and as you can see, we already have this glowy pink color here. And now let's hit zero again and this is looking awesome. Also, in every moment later on, you can select this grid, go here inside the Collider option and change whatever pattern you want here. It's up to you to play around, but I will leave to maybe this first option, die across. Alright guys, that was everything for today's tutorial, short and easy one. And you can create your own background, your own pattern. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, hit that like and subscribe button. And take a look on my channel for even more great tutorials and until next time, stay creative and bye bye!